Yo, 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 what is going on, everybody? Make sure we're in the right channel here. Yeah, there we go. In the in the Discord. Uh, Gordon. Yeah, we're in here. We did some right today. What's up, dudes? <laughs> Hello, Buck. It's Clay. Apparently, I never Just left get in at Ruby River Range if you need me. Apparently, Got you, you never down left here. Discord. Uh, yeah, that's yeah. We don't want to talk about last night. Nope. Oh, chat. What's going on, dudes? We are here. Yeah, I don't even know what's going on here today. I was gonna play uh, Hunter Call of the Wild, but well, we uh, the heck it. We're gonna play Hunter the the. Call the angler. Call, call, call the angler. We're gonna play something today. Yeah. So, yeah. It was it was a long night last night. I don't even know why we did what we did. We were supposed to go to bed, you know, and then all of a sudden we just sat there like dummies. And uh, it's Varus's fault. Yeah, I'm blaming Varus, hundred percent. He, he, yeah, it's, it's it's all his fault. It absolutely, hundred percent his fault. So. We ended up, we ended up just playing. I don't even know why I didn't just turn the stream back on, but, uh, yeah, we ended up just playing the angler last night until like five in the morning for some odd reason. So yeah, kind of got a little bit, uh, a little deep into it, you know, and I went a little, uh, hot dog, hot dog friend, you know, hungry last night it was absolutely fantastic. No, it's probably a good thing we were just streaming last night then. Yeah, probably not. It was probably not a good idea. There's a whole lot of hot dog talk. <laughs> There's so much hot dog talk. I think what's messing up here real quick, I got to check my YouTube. Okay. Good to go. Having through a million things. All right. So, did you get in already? Yeah. Damn. Okay. Well, I guess the matchmaking is working pretty quick. It took a couple of tries, but I got in. Mm, nice. Oh, nice. Yo, yo, like yo, yo, yo. What's up, Shane? Oh yeah, I don't know. We we just we just had some issues last night apparently with the angler. We were just you know. I only jumped on to do one quest while you were setting up the stream for that was supposed to be for today. <laughs> then you jumped on and I was like, oh, it's still pretty early. One hour won't kill me, and then like six hours later, it's like, god damn it. Yep, the power of a shitty game. Let's go. <laughs> this is why this is the daytime game. This is why we played this game during the day. Yes. No more playing the angler at night. I've been dreaming of fish. Man. Why, why did we do that to ourselves last night? So today we are going to be going for, you know, I would like to catch a I really want to catch that that pike. Oh, oh, oh shit! I, I really want to catch a uh, diamond pike, not on the quest, right? So, I think that's what I'm going to be going for. And maybe I'm going to try to focus on the pike and the catfish today. Oh, well, big beefy right here. What's up with this? The first fish of the day, a diamond. <laughs> Let's go. <laughs> Hell yeah, dudes. Let's get some. What the hell are you using? Uh, I'm using a size two popper. As I swear to God, if you say hot dog again. <laughs> I'm using a hot dog. <laughs> Lol, first fish of the day. Diamond. Let's go. You can't get any better than that. First fish of the day being a diamond. Let's get it. All right. Yeah, the crazy thing is, is last night I caught a diamond here too. The last fish I caught was a diamond. I was using the uh, something else though, so. Get some. Yep, we will be going over and playing on Twitch in a couple hours, guys. Uh, we'll be doing some more uh, farm sims, so. 
Sorry for the only the couple hour streams over here on YouTube each day, but at least we're back, right? Just gotta get our sleep schedules. That's what it is. Our sleep schedules are just massacred from this last two weeks. The sleep schedule is just tore up. I don't even have coffee either, man. No, we didn't get that far. It as far as taking a shower and going to. Yeah. Not as far as I made it today. I made it to the poo part. <laughs> I made it to the bathroom part. Huh? Yeah, productive day to day, dudes. <laughs> Come on, fish. Yeah, but really, I'm really trying out these poppers in different sizes. Um, now, well, obviously the trout liked it. The diamond trout like, loved it. What there, size so. are you using? A two. I am using a size two. And the logging that we did last night is up on uh, YouTube, by the way. So I did throw it up there because it got ready for today. So but you know what? A couple hours early, whatever. Who cares. You know what I mean? Had everything done for it. Everything was sitting there. And then before I went to bed, I was like, oh, hey, it looks like it's all ready to go. And it's fully uploaded and fully processed. So I was like, you know what? Let's just uh, send it. Why? Why not? Freaking everybody else likes to break the rules, doing everything, getting ahead and stuff. <laughs> well, what's a couple hours, right? I mean, at least I'm not like streaming on both platforms at the same time, like most of the other people try to do all the time, right? So don't play copyrighted music. You know, releasing a video a couple hours early is not going to be a deal breaker. Nothing came through the lily pads over here. We're gonna eat another nighttime cycle? Probably. No! Not like this! Which means potential for more catfish. True, I can try out my wiener. You know, it's too early to be swinging your wiener. Never too early to swing your wiener. I really need coffee. Damn it. Does your new game, uh, Shane, is your new game the uh, airport CEO? Because I've been seeing you play that a lot. It used to be Civ for like years. Yeah, I'm stoked for construction simulator, man. Thank you very much for uh, picking that up for me and Amanda, by the way. Appreciate that a lot. I was really uh, on the fence with buying it, but the funds being so low. I was like, you know, eh. I'm like, might have to pass up on this one. <laughs> Having fun with the, the airport CEO. Yeah, I mean, those games can be very addicting, right? Like the, the management tycoon type games. Like, man, they can be so addicting. Should have got something by now. Oh, absolutely. I mean, like any, any decent multiplayer game that looks like it might be in our wheelhouse is and things I'm trying to keep my eye open for lately.
what am I running on this? Well, here. Like, I think we'll get a lot of playtime out of construction sim. Sure. I mean, that's that's what it boils down to, right? Is is getting a bunch of playtime out of these games. Something that's fun for uh, for me and Amanda, and if there's other people that want to come in and play, then as well as that too, right? So, some stuff we can bounce around too that's in the same genre of the simulator categories, right? So. Oh yeah, absolutely. I mean, with with two different maps and all the equipment and stuff like that, there's always going to be something to do, right? It seems like seems like there's a lot to do. It seems like there's a lot of cool little things and to be able to build different things and stuff like that and different like different little, you know, projects you can do and it lo it looked pretty good. It, like I said, a lot of the stuff looked generic, but I mean, hey, they tied it all together, right? Got to give them credit there. The ground deformation looks like it could be a lot better. It's real clunky and stuff, but I'm using the hot dog with a size four because realistically, I think I've only ever seen. Am I using the hot dog with size four? What are you doing here? Is I just using. Is it going nighttime again? Looks like it. Damn it! There's fast travel in the game also, but would hope you can uh, have it turned off for uh, multiplayer. Yeah, it's going nighttime again. Sorry, guys. No, it looks like we're getting a chance at those catfish. Oh, something going on with the lighting. We have a fish out here swimming in front of us. But we're not we don't care about him we mainly want ourselves a nice catfish we're looking for a big catfish especially at nighttime because it says that the diamond it says it doesn't say diamonds but i would assume that the trait on the catfish it says that it, they're more aggressive at night would mean that they're more aggressive just in general at nighttime and that's maybe when the diamonds come out But you know, I'm gonna move locations. I'm gonna go down to this location down here and see if I can't hit some catfish down here because there's a lot of lily pads down in this area. And did you want to come with me, Meta? Yeah, I'm coming. Didn't know if you were uh, into coming down here or not. But check out this bridge. Maybe hit down here a little bit and move my way over. Uh, during the nighttime here real quick and well, especially I guess take advantage of why we have nighttime right to go for these big cats Oh, this area looks a little a Little nice That yeah, we're running a five hook with a Not a five hook stop throwing that in the water. Damn it throw in your damn wiener All right, let's see if we can, uh, yeah, we really want that. I want that diamond catfish. I want my main, the, I want the diamond catfish, not on the quest. And I want the diamond, um, Northern Pike, not on the quest, on quest, uh, roaming. We've been on the hunt for those and we've been, we've been on the hunt for them in a, in a good location, right? Somewhere where they repeatedly do it. I'm watching a British guy playing the German map and it looks really nice. Yeah, from what I've seen so far, it looks it looks pretty decent. Jared, what's up, buddy? How are we doing today? We are doing good. Just a little uh a little tired. We played a long, long time last night. That's why I don't want to talk about it. That's why we got delayed a little bit here today. And then you know, I was like, you know what, I really I'm kinda still like cross-eyed from playing so much last night. 
bigger we'll just get on and play some some angler which is a great game for that it's a good game for just kind of waking up and man is like you know the angler seems like a great game to be playing early morning we during the up, day have some coffee during the day during the you know during the morning for us like one of like a stream to start out with right so, when it's not six in the morning yeah when it's not six in the morning so apparently we're junkies yeah we got we got fishing problems here guys we really do i still blame virus i 100 percent blame virus at least, we, at least we didn't get busted in by our grandma yeah true got in trouble <laughs> He's probably still awake. Probably still in trouble. Probably. <laughs> yeah, doing doing good though, man. Doing good. Trying to get back into the schedule. Our sleep schedules are destroyed. But uh you know, I mean getting back into getting back into a uh, you know, a pattern and playing and stuff like that is 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 our main goal here, guys. Getting back in, relaxing, playing games. We have a new, another new upcoming game. Thanks to Shane. We'll be playing uh, Construction Simulator on the 20th. Yeah, yeet. Go, right? We'll be continuing to play. Catch nothing. Are you catching anything? No, I'm not really catching anything right now at all right here. See fish jumping. I see fish. I don't know what's really here but i'm just trying to flip out a few lines to see if we can get some uh, catfish to maybe pop up i'm not gonna stay here for too long on this but you catfish i don't know if it's a catfish but it's pretty fat in the water naked that's fine. You were crouched down on the dock last night, catching hot, catching catfish with a hot dog butt naked. Yeah, that's late night fishing around here, boys. Crouched down on the dock butt naked with a hot dog. <laughs> Let's go. What'd you catch? A silver largemouth bass, 5.42 pounds. Okay. And I forgot to get my OBS up and running again. Oh no. Oh god, split driving construction vehicles run. Yeah. Alright, the spot sucks. We've had no dingers on the uh, catfish here. Oh, yeah, the bass. I mean, they say these things are more active at nighttime. I think it's some bullshit. Yeah, they say that, but in the spot I found last night, I was banging them out during the day, but I couldn't catch shit at night. Yeah, I'm not sure. I'm not, I'm not really positive what's going on with that. Mechanically, like, why they say these fish are more active at night, but we can never get them at nighttime. Just right. like this thing says it doesn't like hot dogs, but magically likes hot dogs. <laughs> Everybody magically loves hot dogs. Do you want my wiener? I'm not answering that. Right. Oh, Beefy just jumped here in front of us. That's not what we're looking for, though. That's just a stupid. It's just a stupid rainbow. You don't really need to fish under the bridges. Under the bridges are a little busted, but generally the catfish will come out and uh, hit these, right? He's actually a pretty decent size. Let me switch to a uh, cheese bait here. Switch to some cheese. Cheese. Goes in the water. There we go. Come. There he is. There's Beefy. Coming in for it. Go, Beefy. Yep. 
Yo, you want to hit it? Let's go. Come on. So how long do you guys think it's going to be before they put a DLC out for this game? Gross. You think they're going to put one out next month? A couple months. I right, was try cheese for a little bit. See what happens. Is that I'm really focused on just the catfish, but the cheese will catch catfish and other things. Oh, hey, there we go. What up, Bresky? I see you out there shaking that ass catfish. Let's go. He went right for the cheese, but not the wiener. Boom. Busy watching your viewer uh viewer challenge. Yeah, that was a that was a good series, man. Which one? The viewer challenge for uh, Gold Rush. Yeah, that, that turned out to be a really good series. Um, you know, complete playthrough. Lots of hard little challenges everybody put against me. Every minute of the gameplay was streamed, so... All of it was on there. Not one missing episode, so... Hell yeah, man. Success. Good finale. We had a good, fun finale. Yeah, I think I think after we uh, beat up construction sim for a little bit for a little while, that'll be probably a good time for me to, um, you know, possibly start up the next. Uh, probably start looking at starting up the next uh, Gold Rush playthrough, uh, but this one's gonna be a lot faster. I'm not gonna, uh, not every minute of it, it's gonna be live streamed. Oh, whoa, we got some big bass. Oh man. Oh, we got some big bass here. Oh, let's go, bro. Hold on. Let's change up the change up the bait. Go to a minnow. Boom. Oh, big boy's going for it. But the next the next gold rush is going to be a lot different, right? Almost couldn't say it. Yeah, no doubt, right? Oh. <laughs> now the next the next playthrough is going to be a lot different, right? So it's going to be it's going to be a a massive difference between this new one and the one the one we just did and the other playthrough. But not all of it's going to be live streamed. Not all you know a lot of it's gonna, a lot of it's going to be recordings. Um, so hopefully, cause I've never done a gold rush. I've never done a gold rush series. That's just been like 30 minute episodes, right? So far in seven, in seven years, never, I've never done it. Just like a 30 minute gold rush segment, you know, like play, re record, play, talk, talk while I'm playing and then record it and ship it. I've, you know what I mean? No, no real editing. Just, just go. Right. So. Figure possibly doing that and smashing out quite a few things. Also doing some big, anytime where I do play more than a few hours, um, smash out a ton of like montage video of digging, right? And digging out the claims and stuff like that. So it's definitely going to be a long, a long process. Uh, it's, it's, you know, it's going to be a 200 hour grind, right? So. In any way I look at it, it's going to be 200 hours. Ooh, that is a nice fish right there. Yo, what's up, mofo? Oh, man, we just warped daytime. What? Uh, hey, Buck, if you need oh. me, I'll be down. There goes nighttime. Uh, 
Uh, do you know if they will release time scale for um, console? I'm not sure. We have not heard much information on uh, console yet. As far as I've heard, as far as I know, they've kind of they've kind of benched it for a little bit while they work on the while they work on the game in general. Right. So that means what that means is they're not a, they have an abandoned console. They're just trying to work on a lot of the key elements of the game in general before they report it back over and then update console. Is it going nighttime again? What is going on? It's not fully daytime. It's tricking you. It's still nighttime. No, we're getting warped around. We're getting phased into multiple servers or multiple. We're getting phased. Shouldn't be doing that. Oh, damn it. Yeah, so uh, I think for console console players, it is sad. I, I do 100% agree it is sad, but Hello, Buckaroo. I'm down you know, in Emerald Lake for a while. Catch you later. On, honestly, with Gold Rush and, and console, it shouldn't have been pushed to console yet. It, it shouldn't even have been close to push to console. I know that sounds weird, but it's kind of what happens when everybody complains, right? Everybody complained. Everybody trashed on the developers, you know, rush this game to console, rush it to console, rush it to console. Hurry up, give it to us on console. Hurry up and give it to us on console. And they weren't ready for it. It wasn't, it wasn't ready yet. And everybody wanted it. And it just, it, this is what happened. I mean, I mean, honestly, they gave it for what I know that they had to do, which I can't talk about. Um, what I know they did to it and what you guys got on console as console players, it was amazing. Like, honestly, with how little bugs is actually in it. I was kind of shocked. There is some bugs and it's missing features that PC has, but that's because it's like I said, they, they can only, they took it, they had to rewind it back to a port that was better when it was sent out and then they sent it out to be ported. But overall, I think the game is a good working version. I think that's why they're not touching it right now. So it's better to leave it in its current state than mess with it and potentially break it more and not be able to fix it right at the moment because they're focused on other things. There we go. Go for that uh, that stuff, right? Get it. Get this big old boy over here. Like the last thing you'd want them to do on consoles break something and be another year out and the game's even worse off right so yeah you're struggling with payments on the claim and that's a uh, no good this one could be considered a lake yeah we're just in like a little river area there is catfish here but I'm gonna go down more with this way. You wanna come with me? Up on a boat? Yeah, I'm going. There's shit all here. Yeah, it's kind of poo poo. I figured I'd stop and try it out. It looked look like an interesting little spot, but, you know, it is what it is. Foresting here. Um. Lake Tourmaline. It Tourmaline. Let me know when you're ready in the boat. What up, girl? Like them boots? 
At least I can see you this time. Last time you were nothing but underpants in a fishing pole. Yeah. Oh. Underpants in a fishing pole. Okay. We got some bass and stuff here, it looks like. We got a bat. It looks like a bass in the water. It's hard to see. He's right there by my bobber. Ready to hit my line. There he is. Oh, no, wait. I'm not a bass. Yeah, rainbow trout. Damn. All right. What's up with the rainbow trout today? Like spike. Am I also making a series on this game? Um, I mean, we're just we're just streaming it and playing it, right? So, not really like planning on making a series on it per se, but mainly just kind of streaming it and hanging out, right? So that's. That's most of my content is streaming and just hanging out. I mean, some people would call that a series, but I just call it streaming, right? It's so. Oh, I see a giant pike over there jumping. Let's go for him. If we can't smash him out. Yeah, I mean, I put a poll up in the, um, I put a poll up in the community tab for, uh, YouTube, you know, and, and, and kind of asking, you know, what people would like to see more of, like, on the channel. Like, how-to videos, or you guys just, would, would you guys just rather me spend my time, you know, playing with Dopey, and, or doing viewer challenges, and things like that, so it was an overwhelming amount of boats towards playing with dopey and doing viewer challenges right so it was a, a freaking landslide so out of like 80 something votes now or something like that so i mean and i know and i know how you guys i can, I can guess how you guys feel right you guys are like well every time you go to make videos and stuff like that you're just gone from streaming you're just absent because you're focused on doing that and i would agree and i we talked about this yesterday is whenever I go to make videos, I try to put a lot into them and I try to make them decent, but maybe I'm overthinking them a little bit too much, a little bit, but it's, you know, I don't, I don't want to just be like, I don't want to just put the video up and it's just what we're doing right now. That, that seems stupid to me. We already do this anyways. So that's not a video. That's just a live vlog, right? That's not, that's not a, that's not an edited thought about video where you cut out all the extra bullshit. Right? Like, I don't, I hate watching videos like that where it's just what we're doing now. That's not a video. That's a live stream. You just cut it off. That's all you did. Right? So for me, it's, I, I struggle in my brain to, to, to not sit and spend a lot of time doing something that takes me away from doing other things. Right? So it's, it's a hard one for me. I, I, I understand completely as far as the viewer stance goes because every time I go to put videos out, I have to take so much of a break from doing everything else. And, while I do like making videos, but they don't get shit for views. So I waste all that time and that takes all that time away from streaming where I could just literally help somebody in the same period of time with them jumping on the live stream. Right. So it's kind of, it's kind of always been that way too. I only, I only really have one video that's done well, really well. And that's even just kind of eh, iffy. Which is the viewer, the not the viewer, but the um, the gold rush, how to start, how to start gold rush with the hog pan, right? The only video that's really done well. It smells fishy in here. Uh, Pike must have not been happy enough to want to eat that one, but did not get it. What's up, bye? He didn't want it. 
I ain't catching nothing. I don't, I'm not catching nothing either. Are you going for catfish or what are you going for? Catfish, bass. Just had to talk shit. Had to talk shit about it? What'd you get? Bronze Northern Pike. Bronze Northern Pike. Just me and Dopey fishing today? Uh, for the most part at the moment. I mean, we were going to play Hunter, but... We scratched that. That's and that's also how it goes too. I know some people are like, oh man, I was really looking forward to Hunter, but it's like, you know. Gosh, damn it, stop hitting the button. When you play all week long, sometimes you just wake up and you just don't want to play that game for the day. You know, you know what I mean? You're like, ah, yeah, I'm good. Oh, no, I'm okay. Yeah, I don't know. It's 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 a tough one. It's a tough one to say is it's just better to get on a live stream, right? You just want Bambi to live longer? Yeah. I, I was we, we burnt out. We burnt hard last night. So today's kind of like Man, we we just kept playing and playing and playing. I don't know what we were doing. I, I was even thinking in my head, what are we doing right now? Why aren't we going to bed? We got to get up a stream tomorrow. All right? We're going to push stream back again. Right, like I'm trying to keep, I'm trying to start at a certain time so that way we can make sure we have time at night time to get off the computer and do other things, right? But no, it's not working out that way. Streaming on both these platforms is really kicking our ass, but you know, we have to. There's, there's no other, you know, Twitch going the way Twitch is going, and uh, YouTube doing what YouTube's doing. We kind of have to do this. Now it's all it's also nice too because you know the only reason why we left to Twitch in the first place was because you guys were getting all timed out and a lot of people couldn't even type in the chat and things like that, right? So in YouTube. Or YouTube, yeah. So it was it was really horrible situation. So we didn't really want to leave in the first place, but things happen. Yo, what's up, Oz? How you doing, man, man? Why are we catching so many rainbows today? What is going I'm on? I'm catching a lot of pike. Catching a lot of rainbows. Oh, it's because I'm using minnows. That was a decent, that was an okay one, but. In Pike Alley though right now, so that's kind of why I want to be here. But I, I think I believe there's catfish down here too. Well, daytime's just smashing around. Here we go. Goodness sakes. Ah, nice, nice, nice. What's going on out here? Oh look around on the south side here got massive lily pads out here just tons of them what i noticed with the um what i noticed with the what's it called the the trout is they have a massive attraction range like they'll come from all the way off your screen like to get the bait Yeah, I kind I kind of want to hit this area up with uh with Pike here a little in a little bit while it's once it gets to uh, morning slash daytime. How much just got off work? Need to run an errand or two before I can get any game time in. Hell yeah, man! We doing sufficient for a while, and then uh, feel free to come on in. And we'll be uh, moving on over to Farm Sim and going over to Twitch a little later. Getting some angler in here for a bit. Waking up a little bit. Still need to make some coffee. Oh, sounds good, man. Sounds good. We 
We always got plenty of logs to pick up. Let's just fish this, uh, this lily, this lily pad between the water and, uh, the lily pads. Let's kind of fish that out a little bit. <laughs> Don't remind me. <laughs> Getting struck, struck, not only struck out, but you can always milk the bulls. <laughs> that job always needs to be done, right? Man, this why is everything such ass today? See him out there jumping in the, in the pads, but wait, is it gonna be nighttime again? It's already dark on my screen. No, game, fix your shit, bruh. We just hit. This happened yesterday. This happened freaking yesterday, man. We got like, we got pummeled with darkness for like the first like two hours of playing. That's beautiful. Awesome. We, we really like how, how beautiful it is, but we would also like it to be daytime at some point. Right? Like they were supposed to fix that and then it seems like they made it worse. Like, cause like you can, you can sit there and then all of a sudden like, You'll be like just ending your nighttime and then all of a sudden it'll phase you into a different world. And then all of a sudden it's like, oh, it'll warp right through daytime and warp right back to nighttime. You're like, oh, come on. I mean, it'd be nice if there was more fish biting at nighttime, right? But I'm not really finding much of the nighttime action other than these fish in multiple locations that we've been testing. So kind of trying out right so it's been kind of, kind of lackluster at night and which is a bummer because we've been sitting at nighttime for quite a bit Big yawn, big stretch. Get it, come on, right here in this, this freaking thing. Just smash this popper. Let's go, buddy. Man. Horrible. Such such an impatient fisherman today. <laughs> like. It'd be a lot better if I could see the damn fish like a throw it at its face. I know, there's nothing, nothing's really jumping here right now. I haven't seen any bubbles or nothing. I know. I, I really haven't. I've only seen them way out in the lily pads. Hey, look, it's Ryan. That's who did it to us. Ryan made us warp into his world. What up, Ryan? You can hop into Discord, bro. If you want. This is why I can't play fishing games. I watch you and think, man, I just want to love to be sitting, up, sitting there drinking a beer on the side fishing. Uh-huh. Ah, 
Ah, playing flight sim and the angler at the same time. I got you. I got you. Y'all good. This spot has been pretty notorious for Pike and yeah, Pike. Apparently a rainbow trout. And, uh, yeah. And I don't know why the rainbow trout are here so much right now. Oh, 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 bro. Oh, bro. Oh, 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 I just saw him. Oh, did you guys just see him? Oh, he's right there. What is he? Oh, he's a gold. Yeah. Well, we know they're here. All right. He hit it. He hit it. He hit it good. He came to the surface. He just, he surfaced up and then he was just, uh, he went for my popper, my size two popper. So. Careful, monster pike in the area. Pull breakers. You think you might be close to finalizing your wife's new build? Hell yeah, man. Fishy, fishy. Looking for that diamond monster. I see a lot of fish jumping out there in the thing. Right out, out in front of us over there. Directly out in the lily pads. Yeah, just go ahead and reel it in, and I'll, I'll move the bow here. This area sucks. We need to move into the lily pads more. Not bad, not bad. Good little build for her. You just catch another rainbow? Yeah, 16 pounder gold. <laughs> A 16 pound gold rainbow, huh? Yeah, that's all you need. That's all you need, right? There's no point in building something that's like super crazy, crazy hardcore, right? When you just don't need it.
Come on. Do what we want. Where's that big old freaking pike? We know a 15, a 15 pound pike will eat my line. So that means that we know a diamond will as well too, or my, my lure, right? So there's one here. It seems like the rainbows will hit this thing too. So. Pick up the speed a little bit here. Nothing. Looking at a 5600G. It specs out to a low end GPU. Striking complete ass right now. All right, this area sucks. Like we're not hitting nothing. Are you guys hitting anything decent? No, I haven't been hitting anything. Looks big time. No doubt, man. Not gonna catch nothing like this. Holy lily pads are, are just not in our favor today. I mean, normally I use a frog in here, but or a swim bait, but I really am the rate that I was hitting the pike with this popper. I really want to stay with this popper. Seems to really hit those big pike really well with this size too. like paint drying simulator you can make it you put me to sleep game come on man Ryan's catching stuff. What'd you get over there?
What's going on over there, Derby? Oh, I'm having a hard time even get my freaking stupid rod to cast. Oh. 15 pound rainbow? Like, it'd be nice if they <laughs> got some more fish in here going on. Hmm. All right, I'm teleporting out of here. Happens with a minnow. You know what? No, I'm not even, I'm not even gonna give this place another chance. Okay, I'm teleporting. Boat is going to be gone in five, four, three, two, one. I was gonna say, I don't think you'd have much luck with the minnow because that's what I've been using. That's what you were using? Breaking out, huh? you call this one rot on the rocks everyone starts somewhere but anyone who's anyone starts with the greenhorn this baby has a smoother learning curve than a minnow spin this little beauty activates a special sense organ in the fish called the this lateral line boot. system pretending to be prey at a distance pretty neat huh could be yours screw you guys are going to another lake Where did you even go? Going to the main uh main hub real quick. I'm just looking at something. Or let's say looking for mm, at least she left her pants on. Damn right. And the dude that's sitting down glitching by the board. <laughs> Bridge. I'm going to try monofilament and see what happens. Yo, what's up, Melon? Here's what I've got. The 
The show packs a powerful punch for a palatable price. You don't need a mortgage for a bait casting reel that won't let you down. Think about downsetting one of my poles here. Um... The Mint is Wright's top end bait casting reel, replete with a reliable pinion gear to support you through thick and thin. Oh, filament 16 is what I'm going to be looking for. A stellar for, actually. bait casting reel that isn't called the basking shark for fun. It carries just enough weight to feel secure and satisfying and won't sacrifice one iota of maneuverability when it comes to a catch. Fluorocarbons suck. Add in. Need a smaller. I'm not, yeah, I'm not sure what they really plan on doing with the the whole thing. It'd be it'd be nice to kind of really see. Let's see, these are my backpacks. I have two of the big boys with us here. But I think we're gonna take those out. Ah! Damn, all up in my face with your shit. Holy naked. You're take naked. I kind of want to go with a oh, go monofill with that one. Right? Okay. Yeah, sure. Why not? It's a little different than Seattle, but boy, is it beautiful. Okay. okay. This guy has a lot of purple on. All right, I am looking for area. Let's just pick an area. Um, sure. Let's try this area. I'm, I've been using braided line for everything, and I think I'm going to move away from the braided and try the monofilament and see how that works. Steve, because I'm thinking that some of these fish might not be hitting on these things because the braided line is so visible in the water. So if you can think of it this way, a lot of games are coded where it's like, okay, this line has an attribute. The attribute equals this. This attribute equals the fish don't want to bite it because you have this many points and do that so many attributes. Hide my game forever a little. Crash? Hello? Hello, game? You just took up the loading screen? No! Oh. Game pound. And open the game back up here. One second. Here's a curl. We're playing call the wild app running. The app is not running. Um, Really? Crawl, crawl, delete. Uh, the angler. They're not running! Test. All right, let's try it. There we go. Okay. <laughs> Sorry about that, guys. How dare you?
The game's like, oh no, he found out monofilament. Ah, crash. Rods, we sell them. Welcome to Taylor's Tackles. Make sure I have my rods. Okay. All right, let's try this again. There we go. Hmm. Let's fish down this water line right here. Bring a couple, like I said, bring, bring a few different setups. We brought a, the bait caster out. We brought the, all the other stuff too that we need, right? So. All right. First things first, let's try with our number four pole. We just pick this bad boy up. Let's toss this in with a spinner. Nice, nice. Red line, sweet. Since we're using a spinner, we're just going to go with a consistent. Yeah, it's it's hard to say what they're going to do with the reputation, right? No, it's going to be nighttime again. You can kiss my ass, game. Come on. Are you acting serious right now, dude? Please go right past nighttime. I don't. Hey, Buckaroo. Down on the range if you need me. Buckaroo, I'm about ready to shoot you in the head. Are you serious? Yeah, see a fish going for it. Oh, bam. <laughs> you have an bass. I don't even want to look at it. It's so small. Well, <laughs> I mean, I guess I can just pull the freaking wiener out. Because, well, it's nighttime again, so that's freaking awesome. Can you go swing your wiener again? I'm just gonna swing my wiener all day long. Bait fish. What? what I mean about the nighttime shit, like, dude, it's, it's horrible. Come on, fishy. Sorry, guys, I wish you didn't have to eat so much nighttime, but apparently the devs don't know how to freaking build their game correctly. The stream's actually not that dark. It's actually pretty light. Freaking constantly getting freaking nighttime. Like, we're only trying to help you catch your, your diamond, <laughs> your diamond channel catfish.
beefing. And what'd you just pull out? Silver pike. Silver pike? Nine pounder. Nah, much. what's up, Justin? Trying to get that fishing in. Watching the Sony uh, state of play. Yeah, I was uh, looking at that. I saw it was. Uh, I saw it was live. Oh, damn, I didn't put mono filament on these ones either. Shit. Gosh, damn it. Oh, hey, we're going. We're going through a time warp again. And we're at daytime. Let me guess. Well, it's dark on my screen. Let me guess. Someone just warped into us. Wow, this guy's name is seriously Truck Stop Push Pop. <laughs> there, there, now matches Twitch. <laughs> yeah, well, I guess I'm going to try this little spinner here and see what happens. Now that it's daytime again. Oh, hey, it looks like it might be going back tonight. Oh my gosh. Now it's daytime on my screen. No, the, the sun is just warping through this fucking sky. Yep, there goes the there. Hey, Buck, I'll be down the Emerald Lake Plateau outpost in a Bro. Plane. See you there. No wonder I can't catch any fish. The game's constantly just switching time of day. The star, are you, you gotta be shitting me, bro? Are you? Are you? I think it's. Are you guys trying to connect into play right now? Is that seriously what's going on? Like, so, why? Why am I warping so much? Or, yeah, that's what it is. You guys are all <laughs> trying to join into my world. Goddamn, bros! I might. I might have to turn multiplayer off. Cause like I've been eat like the last three streams, I've been literally just eating hours and hours and hours of nighttime. I can't catch a fish when my time keeps warping like this. Getting to be ass. Devs have seriously got to fix it. It's not your guys' fault. It's the devs, 100. They need they need to fix their they need to fix their fucking game. Like stop with the damn server phasing bullshit. Like that's stupid. Can we, can you just give us private servers, please devs? Like, so we can play with our friends and not have to like warp time 24 seven is stupid. Absolutely annoying. Like it's all it's been is just nighttime. Oh, we finally, nope. Now it's back to nighttime. Oh, wait, 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 no daytime. Nope. Now it's finally back to nighttime. 
Oh, that's gonna be daytime. And now it's back to nighttime again. It's like, holy shit, man. It's just super annoying. It's just like kills your kills you your drive to want to play when you're like trying to catch fish and then all of a sudden it's just like constantly fucking changing times. And that's because they're trying to do this fancy server thing. It's like, oh annoying. It's annoying at this point. Surprised they're they they've definitely um uh, Even when you're playing on your own, it's all over the place too. Yeah, I don't know. It's just absolutely stupid. I mean, I got disconnected. I came back in. I believe I joined into you guys. I'm not even sure. Did you try to rejoin to me, Amanda? Or Yeah, I tried to join into you. Okay, yeah. Ugh. So horrible. There's, it was, there's. It was still daytime when I joined, though. Yeah, it takes a while for it to do anything. Bird, I'm just gonna go for. I'm just gonna use the spinner out here. See what happens. They should just uh, make day night player based on the fish. Yeah, it's it's hard to say what they're what they're trying to do with it because the players like warping warping through time constantly is irritating because like you can spend all this time waiting and all of a sudden you're like okay nighttime's coming I'm getting ready to do this or oh, I'm waiting for this to pop up or only this fish is available kind of roughly during this time and then all of a sudden you just get fucking bamboozled and you've been waiting for hours you're like oh yeah I'm finally gonna get to be able to fish at this time and then all of a sudden pwned. Oh, so irritating that in the multiplayer. It's just irritating. I mean, they fixed a lot of things with the game. Don't get me wrong. They've been, they're definitely working on it, but man, things that are irritating are super irritating. Like, I absolutely hate dark games like this. Now from all the years of playing dark, like gold rush in the dark and streaming. I just, I absolutely freaking despise dark games now. Like it just, it pisses me off. That's actually why I've been really liking farm sim is because I can just control the damn day. Like, okay, cool. Freaking make the damn freaking time. Just did day daytime. So we can actually see what's going on. The hunter has friends only servers. Why can't this? I'm, I'm kind of confused as well. Why they didn't just do the same thing that they had already had that already worked. I'm really, I'm really kind of shocked actually. Makes no sense to me whatsoever. You like that little bait? Maybe. Liked it. Like you liked it. Large mouth bass. Yeah. I mean, still love the game. Still like grinding on it. It's just that, man. Like I said, the things the things that make it stupid, really make it stupid. You know what I mean? Like, ugh. And there's such trivial things too that shouldn't be even a problem, right? So, I can overlook the shitty fishing mechanics, but, man, ugh. You just want to rage, playing in the damn nighttime too long. Go with bass again. Let's throw my wiener out there and see what happens. I mean, I guess this gives us, but, but here's the thing though. Does the game really recognize that it's nighttime right now? I was kind of wondering if it even really does. Do the fish even really recognize that it's nighttime, right?
go for my hot dog. You know you want the hot dog. I just saw you surface. You love hot dogs. There you go. Telling you, catfish love the wiener. This is an 8.4 pound. Bad. Wrong. Wrong. Oh. This one. I'm getting a kick out of the people that think that these fish that they see on in the water aren't actually fish you can catch. I'm not, I'm, I'm starting to see that in multiple areas now. Multiple streamers. Like we said, if you can see it, you can catch it. Well, maybe. Well, it depends on if you're throwing the right bait at it. That's all. Because you can see it doesn't mean you're going to get it. Ooh, ooh, what is that? Oh, oh, baby. Is that a big ass? That's a big soger. Look at him, dude. He's fat. Look at the little baby one in the water. Look at that monster. Oh, he's on it. He's on it. Is he coming to it? What's he going to do? Oh, shit. Leave it there for a second. Doesn't want it. No, he does want it. Make up your fucking mind. He's not attracted to it right now, but he, he is. 100% is. Okay, swim back over there. Turn your shit ass around. That might be the biggest one I've seen. Why? Come on, man. Please, please tell me you want this. Not attracted to it yet. Oh, is he now? Come on, bro. Come on. You look like a diamond. Do what Rihanna said. Shine bright like a diamond. Let's go. Dude, how slow are you? You shit! Could you swim any? I can just catch you. Swim faster, dick face. I'm here. I'm giving it to you, man. Here, you shithead. <laughs> Stupid fish. Could you swim any faster? Where'd he go? Where is he? Oh man, I lost him now. Gosh damn it, where'd he go? I walk away 10 feet and he's gone all of a sudden? We're right there. Where did you go? You suck! Oh, there he is.
Dude, these fish are just too slow. I'm confused. Are they just... Do I just, is my reel like just too fast action wise? Posted a new trailer for Hog. He bit onto it, but oh, that is him. Silver Sauger. Okay. Say these are night fish or active at night. Oh, it's slaying them now. Woo, we got a jumper. Mouth bass. He's a small guy. We're using a small little hook here today because it looks like there's just gonna keep casting out here, see what happens. Gotta make God of War Ragnarok looks awesome. We are just hitting them out here now. Changed up to the other reel, which has a slower recovery. Slowed down the, the bait a little bit. We got some flying fish. Whoa. What we're looking for, though. Nice true catching stuff. Well, I changed to a seven spinner. I'm using something completely different, and I'm using monofilament line, the red, the the red one. I have the red one, and just won't let me put it on anything. Got to have the right size uh, here for it. Hmm. Yawn, 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 yawn. Coffee, 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 coffee's needed. I mean, the sun, dude, the sunsets and the sunrises are, are amazing. They look so good. Game's beautiful. It's just, like I said, just a few of the things that irritate you really piss you off. Other than that, I mean, I do enjoy the fishing experience. I think the fishing experience is only just going to get better from here. Right? I think it's I think it's only going to get better from here. 
So you may take a couple steps forward and then, you know, a couple steps back here and there, but I think, I think in general, it's, uh, you know, these guys definitely know what they're doing, right? So. Boom. Oh, oh, he, he's bigger compared to everything else. What is he? He's pulling it. Probably a pike. Oh, on, on a seven hook? He's, he's dragging me? Drag, dragging, huh? What is this? It is a pike. You're right. A 16.7 pound pike on a size seven spinner. What? What? What's up, Ronald? That was such a crazy, that was such a crazy hit there. I was uh, kind of shocked me. Considering, you know, it's like I'm on, I'm on a size seven, but you know, whew, man, that, that was a, I was like, what? He hit hard, right? So, I mean, we're using a super overpowered setup right now, but because we don't really know what's going to be hitting this lure out here. So. Man, good thing I wasn't on like uh, my other setup I was just using. That would just crush my line. Probably would have spooled me out. Hey, come on, let's go. Let's get it. Excuse me, I keep yawning today so bad. Coffee, coffee, coffee. Stayed up way too late last night. Sleep schedule was horrible. Hey, I'm liking this little spinner so far. Size seven. And, and, it, and it caught a 17 pound pike. Like what? Monofilament? And All right, let's throw them out to the jumps. Out here, they're, 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 ooh, what is that in the water right there? See that big old guy? What is that? Big bass? Looks like we got some bass in here. Right down the water in front of me here. It seems like the pike are really, uh, uh, from farm sim last night, we pretty much ended it right then. Oh, you mean last night as far as like, uh, just gaming in general, we stayed up to like six in the morning, man. We should just pop stream back on. I was, I don't know. I wasn't thinking. I wasn't thinking we were like, we, we turned off stream to get ready to go to bed. And I don't know. We just went dumb, dumb. We just, we just dummied ourselves. Missed opportunity to stream, right guys? Missed opportunity to stream. Yeah, we just ended up being dumb last night. Which <laughs> pretty much all it really boils down to. You're addicted, man. I don't even know why either, right? Like I just, I just gotta catch them all. <laughs> I 
Dude, this thing's a pike slayer. What the hell? Monofilament with the with the size seven spinner out here is just murdering these pike. On a constant uh, reel. I mean, hey, I guess it's not too bad to be uh, addicted to a, um, a chill game, right? Don't worry, you're not the only ones. Yeah, man, it was, it's just, I don't know, just nice and chill. It is a chill, relaxing game. It is, it is fun when something grabs onto your line, you know, like the, the can't beat the view, right? You know? Played the fifth. <laughs> Come on, man. Yeah. I'm seeing some decent sized little bass in here, though. I mean, if this spinner's hitting like this, let's just keep trying it and see how it works. I mean, we already caught a 17 pounder, almost 18 pound pike. All right, so let's just keep it up. We'll keep, we'll keep, we'll test this little area out here along this, along this, uh, this channel here. Keep smashing them out and see what happens. I mean, we're, I mean, if, like I said, if we can catch an 18 pounder, hit, go. You never know what it is because it, it's so, when it's big, you know, yeah, it looks like a, she, we're just flicking this thing through the air. Small little buddy. This lure is so small, it has a chance to catch a lot of crap, right? So, which is fine. We don't mind. Hey, whatever. It's okay, right? What the hell? Snapping lines over there? No. Well, he's snapping a line. The monofilament really seems to be increasing my fish fish's catch rate. Yeah, that's what I usually use. A gold mountain whitefish? What? Oh, okay, we're just about getting everything over here. It's all these fish along the shore here. Oh, we got big beefy there swimming at it. It's just fish laying right now, boys. <laughs> uh, it's a good game, man. I'm, I'm glad it... Uh, it, it fills the it fills the void of fishing games for us. It really does, man. Like, I mean, Amanda really actually found us surfs that we I I didn't think Amanda actually really liked fishing games or be into them. But uh, when we were gone, we were playing a little bit of Fishing Planet. She seemed to be uh, pretty into it some days. So, not to prefer, that's the only thing we really had to play. <laughs> yeah, but hey, hey, but but look what happened though out of that. It allowed you to. Go, okay, well, it might be the only thing we have to play right now that's decent, but then now now you can go, well, hey, I actually don't mind fishing games. So added another another game type to your uh, your repertoire that you can play, right? So not always a bad thing. Sometimes sometimes being forced to play on things that you may not have a lot of games to play, and I, you can actually find that you may like a, a game category 
that you may not have ever thought you might like, right? So I just find these games to be chill, right? Like fishing to be a little bit more on the chill side. Sometimes you need that. You just need to sit at your desk and just kind of veg out, read chat, hang out, get your casts in. A lot of stuff jumping. Lots of bubbling out there. Good, good sign. Means the fish are active. And <laughs> yep. Pike. Super bad. I'm gonna go see if, like why won't the thing let me pull my uh, my red mono line out of my backpack or out of my storage. Okay. If not, just buy another one. That's what I had to do. One of mine. Go a little deeper and see what happens. Go real deep, actually. Right down on the bottom and see what, what we got it down there. Couple feet off the bottom. Nice, slow, consistent. Yeah, you gotta buy more one. Let me pull it out of my storage for some reason. Yeah, it's just some items are just glitched like that. It's like I have some, it just won't let me have it. Oh, it. Missed the strike though. Not this time. We got sh we got fish at all depths down there. That's good to know. And this lure is hitting them, so monofilament is definitely good to go. We are just slaying the pike though. What the f going on here right now? Well, we did bring ourselves another. We just mastered out that spinner. We did bring five. We also have, we do know that there is a lot of pike here. So maybe we try to bring out the popper here since, well, we're just, we're just cracking these pike off, right? So I'm wondering how the monofilament works with the uh, popper now. Can we get that diamond? We know there's a lot of pike here. We know they're hitting. But can we bring out the uh, the beast mode and see what happens? We know they like the consistent, but do they like do they like the popper too? A bigger hook. Going from a seven to a two. We have a big giant bass right there in front of us. Down there in the water, it looks like. It looks like a looks like a smallmouth. Whoa, whoa. You see that you see that girthy boy? It looks like we need a minnow on a hook over there right now. Actually reel this in and see what that what that is. He is he is 
good sized. Man, he is a monster. Throw a minnow on a hook. F5 is probably good. Boom. Oh, fat boy. Go. There he comes. Big, big and McTasty's coming in. Doody, doody. Hey, hello, Buckaroo. I'm down at Silver Strat Meadow now, if you wanted to drop by. Hey, he's not too big. Probably like a bronze or silver. Silver largemouth. And they, dude, the diamonds must be huge. See if we can clear the waterway here of uh was a lot of fish out here just running you know spawning around around me oh man, damn beefy mcnasty he's another one holy Another silver. These things are these things are giant in the water. Man, he was just on that shit. All right, let's uh see if there's any more sitting right here. Just we're flipping a five minnow in. We're doing with our float setup because the bass and everything like that. Like that that five that five hook is nice. I see. I think I see a sauger right there. What is that? What are you, buddy? Open that too. Do you like do you like whatever's on that line? I don't know what that is. He he could give two shits. Oh, let's keep trying this out, man. We got we gotta get this we gotta get this diamond freaking catfish, man. Or the not the catfish, but the diamond Conquest Diamond. See what happens. Is that it? That is a sauger out there, isn't it? Of course, I switched to a popper, right? Like, saugers aren't very big in general, right? So, We'll see if this popper works for me. If not, we'll just go back to the spinner. I'm wondering if we needed even smaller popper. Question. Nothing, 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 nothing's nothing sitting on this shit. Thing sucks. What do we bring here today? Boom. Uh, we got a two, we got a four. Let's try four. Let's go, let's go up in hook size here. Stay away from these these bigger hooks, right? I mean, I guess I'd rather catch fish than not catch fish. You know what I mean? Now, I mean, before I was kind of like the mentality: well, we'll you we'll use a bigger hook so that way we only catch the bigger fish. But then we're not catching anything because the big fish that we're going after, there's just not very many of them, right? So they're more rare. uh it's not as bad today it doesn't i mean we have all of our windows closed so 
with our window open here it was just like it was brutal yesterday man i don't my i don't have a headache today so yesterday man i could i was having a hard time focusing because i just had such a wicked headache last four popper ain't popping um Yeah, I bet you can, man. Where you're at, dude. You're right down there, right down that area, man. Like, I don't actually see the smoke. It's like not, everything's nice and clear today. But the other day, man, it was just like apocalypse outside. You couldn't see anything. It was just everywhere. Fog. It was like the, it looked like a thick, thick fog rolled in, but it was just smoke. But you know the weird thing is, is it didn't smell like smoke but yesterday it was clear like it is today but it just smelled like wicked smoke it was it's just so odd right all right these 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 freaking poppers can suck my ass poppers can suck it Go to the five spinner and see what happens. Yeah, it's the it's the one from the U.S. and on the border between uh, Canada and U.S. I think we have a couple small fire fires on the island. Like we don't, we do, our visibility is great right now. But like I was saying, it's the uh, the whole freaking. No, it's really weird. Like the other day, it didn't smell like smoke at all, and it looked like it was the apocalypse outside. But yeah, man, kind of crazy. I know we didn't fish this area out because I still see fish in the water. Got like 20 something fires. Damn, dude. I mean, we didn't really have that many fires here in Canada this year, to be honest. I don't think we did. It hasn't been bad this year. It wasn't as bad last year either. Well, on our on BC, it wasn't too, too bad. Not compared to the year, a couple years before. But then again, maybe it's because everything was already burnt. So, I mean, <laughs> that might be a, a factor, right? We had about a normal amount of fires. I'm sure you demanded this wasn't smoking too much. Shit, no, I need to smoke. I need to smoke right now. It's making me want to smoke. I, I ch only thing I changed up was my damn lure. Let's go back to the uh, I seven. Right, let's toss that bad boy out there and see what happens. Let it sink about twenty. Boom.
Are, how is your guys' fishing here? Butthole. You guys just went to butthole too? I mean, I definitely see fish, so. I don't see fish. Well, yeah, I don't see you either, so. Yeah. You're like invisible. It's just meh now all of a sudden. I'm gonna move. I'm gonna move down the. Uh, I'm gonna move down. I'm liking this size seven, so I think what I'm. Yeah, I think I'm gonna keep moving down this way here. Down this. Uh, this. Uh, rock. This rock area. Move a little bit at a time. Use a size seven, cast out into a fan and fan across and then move and then fan across, move, fan across, move. See some jumpies, some blurbles. Try to cover this whole uh, side of this lake here, I guess. I'm getting a lot of fish activity, but. Oh, I just hooked something on a um, hook size four spinner. Nice. Size four, huh? Size four spinner B. And the sun on the water, they did a good job. Honestly, they did. Like, since they fixed the water a little bit, they actually did a really good job with the map and the water and just everything. Like, it looks nice. Well, honestly, water is a very difficult thing to do in video games. It honestly is, guys. Like, water mechanics are are one of the hardest things that to do. And I, th I think they, I think they did it. I think they did a really good job on it for what they were trying to go for, what they needed asset wise. Uh, yeah, I played, I played some ultimate fishing too. Um, I played ultimate fishing a little bit too as well, and I just, I wasn't a fan of them. I was looking for more open world than just the normal enclosed fishing areas like uh, Fishing Planet and Ultimate Fishing and Rush Fishing 4. kind of like i don't know i'm kind of i was kind of tired of, i got i got really tired of the um there being no fish there and then all of a sudden a fish appears and just runs towards your line i'm tired of that fishing i'm tired of that just the horizon uh as your fishing seems calm and relaxing absolutely man and, and to know that i can run all the way over there Right, that that's that's the big thing for me. It honestly is that is the biggest deal for me, man. Like, to know that I can go, I, if I want to, I can go run all the way up on that big peak over there. <laughs> you know what I mean? Like that that's the thing that that's that's the thing for me that really sets this thing apart from everything else. Yeah, that's why I never played Fishing Planet. I mean, well. I mean, once you once you know mechanically how a game is coded, it adds that. Are you okay with the cheese factor? Is what I like to try to try to think about, right? Are you okay with the amount of cheese that's being shoved in your face, right? Like, are you okay with that, right? Like, is that are you going to feel immersed enough knowing that that is the way the game is played? You know what I mean? Or or are you looking for something different? Like, see, I love Fishing Planet. I do. I actually really like... I don't mind it. It's okay. But 
it's too much of that and not enough of other stuff that needs to be there. There need they fishing planet should have been open world a long time ago. If fishing planet went open world and had a good world that looked nice like this, I'd play fishing planet. I wouldn't care that the, the fishing is pooled out like cheese, you know. I, you know, I wouldn't, I wouldn't mind it, but it's just, like I said, I need that open world immersion is what I'm looking for out of a fishing game. But that's just me. Like I'm saying, I'm not bagging on fishing planet any means or Russian fishing or, or any of those, right? That they have their own play style niche, right? Just same, just the same way as this does, right? They all, they all have their own, their own niche area, right? Even though they're all in the same, they're all fishing games. And I wouldn't, you know, people say, well, the game's free. No. Te yes, technically it's free, but not really. But not really. Okay, let's let's be honest here. When you look at Fishing Planet and the cop, and you if you were to buy everything on the on the thing, is it really free? Same as World of Warships. Yeah, World of Warships is free. Yeah, mm -hmm. I'm nodding with a big giant freaking. Mm -hmm. If you want to suck. If you want, if you want to suck ass. <laughs> so it's like. Yeah, and, th and that's free to play games. Yeah, sure you can play, but there is a shit ton of things you can buy. And of course, you're always enticed to want to buy those things. I mean, I mean, yeah, I, I, okay, I fully get it because I was one of these gamers too, where I had no money to buy things. So I had to look for free games and I had to go, well, I'm just going to be better than everybody else because I don't have the money to pay for things. Fuck that mentality. That is stupid. That is stupid. And I get why everybody has to do it out of necessity. That is stupid. That's it's a stupid, stupid, stupid thing to, to have to do, right? That it's horrible. It's absolutely horrible. You're like, oh yeah, oh I wish I could do what this other guy over here is doing, but you know, sadly I'm fucking poor, right? <laughs> like, <laughs> I, yeah, I just, but I guess hey, that's life, right? You sit there and you're like, man, look at that guy driving the Ferrari. Shit, man, I'm on the bus. <laughs> right? Like, man, shit. This, this sucks. I want to be in the Ferrari. Right? Guess, that, guess that's gaming now, right? <laughs> yeah, it's just, I don't know. It's, it's a funny, it's a funny thing the way that the games have changed. Yeah, micro microtransactions. You know, what are you actually getting for your money? That's another, that's another metric too. That's kind of hilarious, right? Like, what am I actually getting for my money? Right? Like, nah, man. I remember when we also used to sit there and wait for gaming magazines to come out. I remember when they had the demo CDs and stuff like that in them. We'd be just stoked. We'd be waiting for it, dude. Oh, the new copy of this magazine's coming out. Oh, bro. You know what I mean? Like, oh my gosh. Yeah, but you can you can also change all the controls too. It, it, it is nice that you can back drag, but you know, let line out. But it's not really like a. I wouldn't say mechanically. I like Fishing Planet. For me personally, I wouldn't. I don't mind it. I I, I think that uh, I kind of actually prefer the uh, rod and reel on how these guys do it here. It does need a lot of work though. Holy shit, it's rough. I would like to be able to cast different distances though, like a lot easier with like a aiming reticle. I think that that's kind of a missed opportunity there. Um, I would like to be able to see what my performance in an advanced view. Uh, I would like to be able to see that go into an advanced mode and be able to see my line tension, my real tension. Um, I mean, in a sense, in a sense, what I'm doing here, casting melon like this is technically the same thing, right? It's technically the same thing. You have to change that in your settings. But the only thing is, is we can't aim it really. I mean, you kind of can, but you know, I guess in real life, you don't have a big reticle out there and says, I'm going to be able to hit this spot. Exactly. Right. <laughs> so, but you know, it's, it's definitely a, um, 
and I, you know, honestly, I actually do like the way that you, the mouse casting. I think it's, I think it's actually kind of fun. Yo, what's up, Vars? What's up, Marson? Welcome, guys. Welcome. We're just trying out this spinner here and seeing what's going on, but we're just not catching nothing too big. I mean, it's size seven, right? Rightfully so, we're not going to probably catch anything too crazy. I would have caught some like something like some more sauger or but those come out mainly at nighttime, right? Yeah, I would I would I wouldn't mind the aiming reticle for the cast a advanced bar for real rod and line tension so I could really kind of like balance things out a little bit. So those would be two great additions. Um, talking, we're talking some things like, yeah, just, yeah, there's just a couple of things here and there. Obviously fix the mechanics on the pole a little bit. They need to up the real speed back up again. Do you crash Amanda? What? No. We just closed it. No, I'm still here. Oh, weird. It says you, uh, just came into the game. Steam just being dumb. Yeah, it does it for me constantly. Yeah, I'd like to see him add a clock. I agree. A clock would be nice. Time of day. Like water temperatures, a graph. You know, things like that. Like some more fishing traits for the fish. Traits for us would be nice. That'd be great. I would like to be able to be like, like be able to like change my fishing style where it's like, okay, I... I would like to be able to have like a talent tree where I could say, okay, I, I'm a, I, I'm way more efficient in jigging, right? Or, and I get bonuses for using certain things and I get, you know, the talent tree system would be good. Just like Hunter Call of the Wild. I think that that would be great. The ability to spot fish, you know, a little bit easier, maybe would be a cool, a cool perk or a talent, some things like that. A talent tree like Hunter. Uh, is this a DLC? A DLC of Hunter Call of the Wild? No, this is a full standalone game made by the same people. I wish it'd be a shooting shit too. See a big old deer up there and just take a smoke at it. Sometimes I hear weird noises in this game. I mean, I just want to pull up my gun and go shoot it. <laughs> there is Sauger around here, but I just I'm not really getting them. Wrong, wrong bait, dude. Wrong pole. You know, I'm, I'm pretty sure that they will eventually be bringing in things like, um, you know, like bait stands and stuff like that, or bottom feeding or all kinds of stuff. I'm sure they will. That's just like, you know, like I remember, I remember doing alpha testing, right? For, um, for uh, the fish for fishing planet and it was like all it was was haters 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 you know when the game was first released haters 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 constant haters all the way up until years ago and then all of a sudden russian fishing 4 came out and it was like oh this game's the best it's you know they're giving us everything we've ever wanted and then all of a sudden fishing plants like boom they drop all their crap you know and all this new stuff and everything's like peachy and everyone's freaking happy and you know, so, man, I, I just don't know if this reel is going to get these saugers because they're just like, look how slow this thing is. This fish is just dumb as shit. Yeah, it, it just takes a while. I think fishing, I think the fishing game genre is like, no, it's, it's a weird one. It's a weird, it's a weird genre of uh, games. It has, a, it has a weird spot, right? There's so many mechanics that people love from older games. But we all, I think, I think we all in general just want open world. I don't, I don't know. 
can't I cannot catch him on this real speed. Like in general, I I, I think all fishing games need to move to open world. Whoa. For you out there, buddy. I think it just enhances the fishing game in general, no matter what. Like Russian fishing four fishing planet they all need to move over they all need to come out with an open world map there we go ah flying saga ah i would prob i would definitely play fishing planet more if it was open world 100% I've had a lot of good times in uh, Fishing Planet. I mean, since the game actually launched, I mean, closed testing hours, I don't even know, over a thousand, over 1500 maybe. But since the game went live, I've only had like 300 hours since the game actually went live. I, I mean, I did get a copy of the game from uh, the developers of of fishing uh, ultimate fishing too so i probably should do a video on it <laughs> they were nice enough to send me a copy what the hell ew bullshit I honestly think they sent it out to just a shit ton of people, man. Because they were worried that the angler was going to just completely outshine them. I mean, and rightfully so, because if you look at the, if you look at Ultimate Fishing, the first one, it was just garbage, man. It was complete garbage. It, I mean, it was, there was no point in playing that game. Like when you look at a game and there's just no point in playing it because every other game out there has something to offer that's better. It's, it was it's just really bad. Like I jumped in, played it a little bit and I was kind of like, you know, okay, cool. This is nice and all, but what am I really looking at here? Right. Visually, the visuals were horrible. You know, everything seems super generic. Oh, Pike, man. We're just getting struck out over here. Yeah, they just, I think they just blanket sent out a ton. Playaway, Playaway does that sometimes when they feel threatened. They'll just send out to like every content creator, everybody that has like a, a testing account. They'll just send like. 20,000 copies out just to like hit it up. Mm, there's a pike right there. There's some, there's some stuff around here. That's me sees. I don't know. I just, I, I, dude, I couldn't even get into the tutorial. That's how bad ultimate fishing seemed to me. Like I, I just didn't even want to even mess with it, man. After my experience with the first one, I just didn't even care to even mess with it. It just looks like they polished the turret even more. You know what I mean? That's what I felt about. That's how I kind of felt about when I was playing it. But I mean, I guess I should give it a fair shake, right? 
Maybe put some time into it and see what it is. Do a couple recordings. Don't care about him. Yeah, why? Why oh why oh why? I'm gonna Where should you start to fish? Dude, anywhere, man. There's fish all over the place, bro. There's literally fish everywhere. You can just catch them off the main dock. Anywhere, man. What's up, man? Um, where, oh, where? We go fishing here. I'm not sure where I want to go fishing. Would like to keep trying... Looking for something here. Hmm. Interesting. Okay. Go back up to the top here. And maybe work my way north, I guess. This way.
Oops, didn't realize I was on a delay. <laughs> you all good. Like, what is he? Hey, look, you have body again. I do. You're like completely invisible. Like, I couldn't see your nameplate at all or anything. I had to like find you by like the little logo on the map. <laughs> what the hell? Since you took your pole out, you took all your clothes off too. Hell yeah. Pull out, close off, let's go! Size seven. Size seven. I was on the gaming magazine free trial CD discussion when I wrote that. <laughs> hey, you were, you were back a bit then, man. Oh, silver pike. And that was with a uh, three um, spinner bait. Three, yeah. Mm-hmm. Got a DM and everybody, this guy was like, do this here and here, bro. You'll, you'll get tons of Sager, dude, bro, bro. Your Sager is not working here, buddy. Fuck my Sager. Dude, that happens all the time, man. Got no soccer idea. <laughs> There's just nothing hitting here right now at all. I think it's time to move spot. Probably. This place turned to ass. A heartbeat. viruses in the world how dare you, you turned our world to poop the 
<laughs> you turned to shit. Dude, I'm just not catching anything here. Like anything decent. I did I did like the the spinner though. The spinner, the size seven spinner was was killing it. before I bounce out of this area I'm gonna do one thing here first I'm gonna go over to the uh, the pike spot on a boat here Always look around these docks. You'll always see fish sometimes. Right? You, you always because you can see deep in the water, right? Take a look around real quick, and I'm gonna go over to the pike spot and see if I can't uh, slam a couple uh, pike over there. Before we kind of like before I leave this area. Let's go, Ruby. I got my poppers. I got my spinners. So we know we got Pike Alley over here. Look who it is. <laughs> We're here. Freaking bumper boats. All right, spinner it is. Let's go. Seven spinner. Well, hey, <laughs> we just rolled up. If we put all of our boats together, we wall the water world. Go. Oh, bike on. Pike are really liking the spinners, man. All pike. You know what? I'm trying the popper, dude. I'm trying the popper again. I have faith in the popper. The, the, let's go with the four popper first. I'm trying your uh, spinner seven theory there. So far, I found out three works, four works, two kind of works. Well, two. The the bigger you get, the less fish you're gonna get. You you have the potential to get bigger fish, All right? So you gotta keep that in mind. So you you you're willingly reducing your fishing rate by going with the uh, bigger uh, hook size.
Try boss. Can you make a private lobby in this game? Uh, no, you cannot actually. Uh, you can only make, um, you can either only a play it in with matchmaking turned off or matchmaking on. It just auto populates, but people can join, um, in your thing, right? It's a, it's a short bus congregation. <laughs> I'm not, I'm not liking these poppers, man. I don't, people are saying that the diamond slay on these things. Just not seeing it, man. I've been trying poppers for days now. Go five, go five spinner. Oops, sorry. My bad. Didn't have a fish on. My bad. All you're catching is bass right now. It's pretty much what I'm seeing here too is bass at the moment. Nice. <laughs> right. Good job. Mashes into the thing. I mean, I got a pike, but I hope he's got something. No, I don't got nothing. Oh, I just forgot I wasn't on the bobber. Hmm. Okay, I thought you were reeling something. In. No, I forgot I was supposed to be reeling. Hmm. Oh, she's. Go, dudes. Yeah, I'm seeing a lot of bass around here, too, myself. Lots of bass. I actually wonder if the bass are out. Maybe I should be using a a bait. Because we, we didn't hit anything on that. Dead cast. Um pull out the Yeah. Just, just, just do it. We just have to. We we gotta try it, guys. We got it. We got it. We we just have to. I can't not. I do see pike. I, I do see pike. Going to be fishing much longer or hopping into uh, FS22. I don't want to sink in uh, loopy guys. If you're no, you, you go ahead and come on in and play. I mean, I think we're going to be playing for a little while longer, at least another 30 minutes. I jump on in, man. Not like it matters anyways, we're all catching crap right now as it is. We all jumped in anyway. Yeah. Okay, I have seen pay. Okay, well, yep. On. <laughs> the crap. 
I'm seeing Pike. That's what I was trying to say. I don't see nothing. I thought Big Pike just swim through the channel here between. Going, I'm going with a swim bait. A uh, swim bait. I went with a swim bait, but going for the. Uh... All right, Mr. Pike. Where's the diamonds? I know, right? Very first fish I caught today was a diamond. Then it was like, I know, so I was wondering, like, where the F are the diamonds at? We're not catch. I've been trying to. I've been trying to go over the the diamond pike non quests, right? That's what we've been trying. To, that's what I've been trying to get. We've all been kind of searching for uh, non quest um, diamonds. The only one I can catch on the regular is the uh, the lake trout diamond, and I can catch the uh, golden trout diamond on like literally on farm, right? So. Stupid boy girl. You just got a sauger? What were you on? What are you using? Me? No, uh, uh Varus said he got a sauger. Why did you stop yawning? Holy crap. Eight spinner? Ryan, you know you can get another boat just literally right across the uh, right on the other side of the island, right? And it's like I'm stuck. Nothing, huh? jumps over here let's that far over there but we know we know that they love the minnows right we know that they love minnows so this don't oh, man i guess i guess i should just stop being a puss puss and just minnow minnow fishing because it's it's a monster fight they might they're most likely just gonna spool me on this rod if we hook into a diamond, but hey, at least it's a fight, right? See some, some big uh, splashes over there. Let me know if it's okay for to move the boat, Dopey. Yeah, you're good. There you go, excuse me. I'm here, fishy fishy. Whatever you are. I know there's something out here. We keep seeing him jump. We're striking out dead today, guys. Striking dead. Oh, there is something going for it. Looks like a catfish, actually.
I think it's catfish. What is that? Yeah, it looks like a catfish. Oh, 13, uh, 13 pounds silver. Oh, catfish. Huh, interesting. Oh, you know what that means? As soon as I catch a catfish, I gotta pull out my wiener. Hot dog. Oh, big old, a big old cat. Oh, hey, big catfish. It is one thing on our hunt list. We're looking for that diamond catfish non quest. Another silver. Almost 13 pound. Nice fish. They're hitting on the wieners. Uh, five, a five is what I was, what I'm hitting those on. Hello, everybody. Yo, what's up, bro? Just going to join the flotilla. Hell yeah, man. So the, the, yeah. hot, the wieners will only, only go for, um, fish pretty much. I don't think I've ever caught anything else other than a catfish on a wiener. This is one of the only times where we've all been on the same world like Bart is here Ryan's here Oz is here we're both in here I think it is well I can see your boots I can't see you I can see all you guys I see you oh you guys yeah Also, too, just because I'm catching something doesn't mean you guys are going to be seeing the same thing in your guys' water. I see nothing. I don't see anything either, really, floating around. I see a lot of jumps and stuff like that, so I'm just casting the jumps. I see no jumps, no bubbles. The only stupid fish I saw didn't want any. Down, down. Catfish coming around. The bass I see down. Throw it out there and see what happens for a bit. Take my wiener. <laughs> Take my wiener. I see Pike jumping out in that out in the channel out here. Nothing. No, man. I'm I'm getting struck too. 
I got a couple of the. Uh, let's see what's out here. I saw, I saw some fish a little further away. They're like always just out of your casting distance. Sometimes it seems like whenever they jump. You know what I mean? But I think that's kind of because they might be afraid of us in a sense. Oh, catfish is coming towards it out there. Yeah, I see. No, I just fish like fish a bubble because my OBS isn't working. What's that? I just fish like a bubble because my OBS isn't working. What? No, there's no one to look at my fish. <laughs> so it's like you're not getting none. You're not getting no fish. <laughs> I'm struggling out all day. Let me try to swing my wiener harder. Yeah, swing it. Swing it out there as far as you can. Swing the wiener. If you don't get any bites within like 30, 40 seconds, reel it back in, throw somewhere else. When you're using the wiener. Because like one one thing I've noticed is is like the catfish literally have like a thirty foot radius around your bobber that it'll attract. So like thirty feet down. So if like you go max drag, it's like thirty feet down by thirty foot around the radius around your your bobber. Right? It's like it's a massive massive radius. You just got a six pound cat on a wiener. Yeah, the the cats are definitely here. It's just uh, where are they at exactly, right? Like, what are they? Where they want to be? They wanna, they wanna play today. Silver pike. Nice. Yeah, that we know. We know the pike are here. We know bass are here. We know there's a couple other things here too as well. This location actually isn't a bad fishing spot. It's just sometimes it's hit and miss. I think like or, or like everything everywhere is right. Saw that over there is that not what I thought it was back in it's probably a pike so getting a fish visual is the most one of the most important things you can do is getting a visual on the fish itself um, doop. I just saw a catfish over there. Oh, well, maybe that was just a bass. But I know that I saw a so the minnow because I saw a pike over this way. We're, we're pretty much where Oz was. What Oz is at right now. He came up and I saw him. I caught him out the corner of my eye over here. Minnows work great for pike. I mean, I guess leeches in this spot would be really good because all the stuff that bites on the leeches is here. So I would say use leeches too, guys. It'd be a, um, good option I'm going spinners first you open your spinners first yeah I'm trying to dough ball because I've been striking out with everything else that's nice hooker you using five yeah five you know what I'm going I'm going deep and I'm going all the way out there See what happens here 
I always see a lot of like jumping out in this area. But you want to know where I actually were one place. I actually remember catching a lot of pike was when I first got the game. First got the game. There's a lake up here. Up in this area right here. And there was actually quite a bit of pike in there. I lost quite a few lines on that lake. Yeah, that lake, right? I don't know. That lake up there is like Dominator. I might, I might go check it out again. As a matter of fact, I think I might actually uh, head over there now. Uh, check that spot out. Let me know when you're done reeling in, Dopey. Because I got a lot of gear for catching pike on me right now. So if that, and I know there's pike there. Because that's all I was catching up there was, was pike. Yeah, pike lake, man. No doubt. And it's a shallow lake, so there might actually be catfish in there, too. So I'm going to teleport there. Good thing I have a lot of cheese on me too as well, right? So... Heck yeah, I remember you, old lake. We're coming back. Lol, as soon as I get here, there's like shit jumping. Oh, big old bass. Large mouth. We have a water line issue here. Yeah, we got it must be like bass day today like you guys noticed how many bass have been out today everywhere we go there's just been it's been bass 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 now nah, this is on a uh a minnow uh five size five hook with a minnow I guess it's Bass Central out here right now. Yeah, there's a lot of bass here. Holy lots of bass here. I'm down for bass fishing. I don't mind. Still haven't caught that uh, diamond uh, 
large mouth that's not a questy so they're just smashing out silvers right and left Toby, your character is jacked. What the hell? Saw that running around catching no fish. <laughs> you need to eat. Character's starved. You guys trying to figure out how to get here by car? I'm playing with the car right now. I flipped myself completely over to the point that it reset me. I just in here. All right, size seven I'm trying spinner. To hold up on the marathon achievement as long as I can. <laughs> Seven spinners hitting too. Ah, flying pike. Small baby little pike out of here so far on the seven. Be expected. I'm starting to see the pike jump now. Now oh, there's Ryan just parked in the water. Come on, fish. Come on, fish. One literally just jumped on my line. Yeah, the only question is, is how big are these things in here? That's, that's a bass, I think. Yeah. Well, bass. Yeah, lots of largemouth bass in here. Lake that I went to? I don't, maybe it's not. been using one one for the longest time and it I, it seems to get me a better a better rate of fish sometimes i'll use two depending on what it is um like the poppers sometimes i'll even use three and then go stop and go 
All right, so stop and go three actually works really nice. But if I'm doing a constant drag, I'll just do a drag of two. Like sometimes I'll twitch on, on two as well. Mr. Pike. Yeah. Baby Pike. I'm just not catching anything. How's the fishing going? I'm just I'm just using the spinner, Amanda. It's size, size oh, seven. Oh my. Throwing it out there and just reeling in. You're just striking dead, huh? Almost all day. Not your day. Fishing's fishing's is not it today. I'm uh, the fishing is pretty dry today. I'm not gonna lie, it, it it is pretty dry. Like it seems like it's all bass today. I mean, do you guys want to go maybe hit the lake trout area up and see what we can catch go there? Catch a whale. You guys want to go catch a freaking whale? <laughs> right, like. I'm gonna go catch a whale and make up for all the fish I didn't catch today. Like this is like we're just this is just ass fishing today. Not much, Bear. If I were to jump in on over and go play some, uh, go clean up some more logs on the server. We cleared a lot of logs last night on stream. Uh, me, Amanda, Oz, and uh, Varus. We got a lot of logs. I also took off the uh, DLCs off the server, too, so. We're not using them, and no point in gating the server up. But yeah, we got a lot more logs to clear. We put a big dent in it. We farmed over a, we farmed almost over five hundred something thousand dollars worth of logs last night. So there's probably another another fifteen truckloads that's got to be done before we put a extend the farm. I guess at some point we probably should roll over there and uh, whoop ass on some logs, huh? Oh, that is a big bass. Oh man. Is he coming for my bait? What's he coming for? Oh, he is. You see how far he aggroed from away? He was all the way over there by, by, uh, Ryan. When he aggroed onto that bait. See that shit? Dude, I mean, the aggro radio radius is pretty far. Blow the hook down because he can't catch it. It's going a little fast. Come on, what are you? Another silver, man. Yeah, that's yeah, that's he's he's a good size one. Yeah, that's about about five to six pounds. They look to see they look like they should be diamonds, right? What does a diamond look like? I've never i I've never seen one like actually floating in the water, right? I've never seen an actual diamond uh floating around, right? Like bass wise. They must be massive. I keep seeing five pounders, right? But nothing, man. You know what I mean? Oh, no real diamonds. I haven't found a good diamond location for bass. We see a lot of bass everywhere. Same thing as like rainbow trout. Diamonds, yeah. Diamonds are around seven pounds. Seven. I've seen. I've seen it eight and a half, almost nine pound. Large mouth bass in a screenshot, but eight pound golds. Yeah, that's really weird, too, right? Like 
some of these golds that we have seen people pull out are massive compared to the diamonds. So maybe they're broken. See something attracted to it. Slow it down. Slow it down so we can catch up. I am I am liking the um this different line, the the monofilament. little guy the big hooks just ain't working today for me i went whale hunting you're going whale hunting yeah i'm probably gonna go whale hunting too i'm gonna check one spot out here before i do that this little area out and see how this area works that's old trusty rusty I'm gonna go for the trusty beast mode Really haven't fished too much down in here. Man, I really loved what they did with the water. Honestly, I like the changes. They did a good job. Obviously need to tweak it quite a bit more, but Hey, looking good. I like the visibility in the water. Blurriness is mainly gone. Now certain times of the day are harder to see. That's just like real life. It's nice. This area looks kind of kind of tight, man. We can actually see it perfectly down there see anything that comes up and out of it if we if it does hit anything if anything wants to come for it i mean i can literally see everywhere and i don't even see a fish i don't see a fish in the water You guys all hiding back here, fish? You know, um, was this the one that... I want to say that the other one was on the other side of the river where we were, where I was getting the, all the northern, all the, uh, line breaks. I don't think that that's the one. What was that that just jumped? Oh. Well. I don't think that, I do not think that that one's actually the one that I went to the, the, when I first grabbed the game, it might actually be this other one down here between the two mountains to the South of us. No, this was the one I went to up there, but I don't think that that was the one that had all the pike in it. I think it was actually the one, this bigger one to the South.
Try the one with the the lake with the waterfall. Uh, I believe I know where you're talking where you're where you're talking about. Uh, I see some fish in here. We got some smallies in there. I like this area at this time of the day right now because I can actually see what's actually there. I can see perfectly in there. Let's see if there's anything in it. It's just, I think just some smalls hide back here. something real quick here kind of curious i have a couple hot dogs left too actually see my hot dog in the water no everything here looks tiny like super small I you can't see it. You're talking, um, you know, that's, this is, this is an area right here that I have not really fished very much. This whole area down in here. I really, I fished in this area here last night. I fished in this area down along here. Um, I fished over here quite a bit. Nothing really there. That's kind of garbage. You just got a, a 4.7 pound sauger. What the shit? I don't see like any fish floating, but that could not mean, it could not mean you just, just didn't see him kind of blind, you know? Oh, the lake south of me. Oh, this one? What'd you catch it on, though? Try and see what we can do. Inner seven. You got a bird's eye view of this lake, and I only see one fish flying so far. Now let's give it a give it a rip down the channel here and see what happens. Kind of resembles the Australian East Coast. I'm seeing a bunch of little small fish jumping, but is that a spider jeep? sitting on top of a rock when I came back it was levitating above it I'm a mountain goat I just run everywhere yo what's up Eddie not much man just getting some fishing in trying to find some fish today Striking out today. All right, I'm done with this area. Hmm. Midday. All, yeah, I'm seeing some small ass fish in here. Them tanny. Yeah, went out fishing with the boys. It didn't do so well. And this is. Try this one over here. Yeah, 
Like our normal spots just have not been hitting today. We normally crush a lot of fish out of there, but hit up some of these stream. I'm going to hit up some of these streams and kind of work my way that away. I like, the, I like these rocks. Give it a nice reel. We got a seven, seven, uh, hook with the spinner. Take a look and see what happens. I can work my way down here. Throw it down. Looks like we have a fish chasing. If you need me, I'll be down at the main outpost. See you soon. He just can't catch it. He's slow. He definitely was chasing it. Then he kind of lost interest. That so started to slow it down a little bit. Lots of rocks around here. Of course. Silver. docks around here. Any 50k tater fish yet? Nope, sadly. Not that I just saw. Thirty-two pound gold lake trout. Nice. This one. That's a beaut. We got some rainbows right here. Right off this guy's little dock area. There's one here, and there's like one below me, and there's one over there. I can see. Yeah, no big monster, monster tater fish. Hey, not yet. I, re I really wasn't going for the monsters today. I was trying to go for the, trying to go for the non-quest diamonds. Um, the pike and. got him attracted to it we don't want you get out of here uh let's see here let's go down the river a little bit further we see a lot of fish but that's not what we're that's not really what we're looking for
We're looking for some big ends, you know? Beepers, emotional damage. Yep, that's what we're looking for. Okay, let's start. What about in these rocks? Got some white water over here. Ah. Hey, fish. Get on my hook. I uh, will gladly take you and eat you. I mean, there's still so many lakes and so many streams that I have not just walked down and started fishing down. You know what I mean? Like there's so many more areas to, to be at, right? Like there's just a ridiculous amount of just land area to cover. Really, I'm really liking this. Uh, there is kind of kind of tight. I'm getting some large metal bass at this little lake I'm at. Oops. Oh, he didn't want it. What? No, you get back there and bite that hook. You know you need that. Come on. The water's so clear here. Insane. Damn right. I see you. Lots of lots of rainbows down this uh down this lake. Down this little uh river here. Stream going down. And yeah, we'll keep fishing it though. Take a look, see what we got. Seems like we got it's just flooded with uh rainbow trout. As it seems like most of these waterways seem to be flooded with the rainbows. What is that? I think he's glitched out. But I think the fish is glitched. He's just sitting there. Women. You one right there. Grab a hole, buddy.
We're back in a bit. Yeah, we might we might be uh oh did not see which one that one was. We know well it wasn't a diamond. I'll be switching over to farm here farms them here soon. Getting tired of striking out all day today. Got some silver largemouth bass and a couple of channel cats over here. That's it. Yeah. Yeah, I'd probably be jumping on over to farm sim. Yeah, that means we'll be going over to uh, Twitch, guys. If you don't or not follow it over on uh, Twitch, hit me up, dudes. Link is in the description, bros. We'll be heading over there. We'll be uh, doing some more logging. Got to pick up some more logs, make some more money. We've got about an hour and a half to two hours of logs left, I think. Yeah, probably. Seems about that way. Looking around. Of course, we've got 10 minutes of just getting everything loaded in. Yep. Well, that's a little messed up. So we have some fish out here in this action here. Twitch TV DOS in two games. That's what it is right there, boys. You guys drop a follow. And uh yeah, we'll be we'll probably be over there here in a little bit. A couple minutes. See what's going on. There you go. Play a little bit of that. So we normally play over here for a couple hours a day. And then we'll we go over to uh Twitch and play play the rest of the night over there. So like spike and another bronze rainbow and we are just filled by these uh freaking rainbows here today there's a cast right here Look at that janky water line they need to fix. Ooh, that's janky. Yep. We will be back. Uh, we will be playing Hunter Call of the Wild tomorrow. I'm, and it is at 12 o'clock. I'm not pushing it back. <laughs> we will be, uh, we'll be doing do some hunting for a few hours and then we'll probably jump, uh, on farm sim again, uh, later on Twitch. So that's what's up for tomorrow. Uh, we really don't have any other games that on, on our list that we're going to be playing other than this farm sim and, uh, Hunter for, for a little while, uh, until, well, actually, no, sorry that on the 20th construction simulator comes out. So we'll be, uh, we will be playing that. He's going for it. It's really slow. 
He's like, blah, 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 blah. and fishy. There we go. Slow down there for you, Mr. Diabetes. Another silver rainbow trout. Well, shit, yeah, dudes. Okay, we're going to give everybody time to uh, jump into the server and stuff like that. And uh, me and Amanda are going to turn the stream off here for the day. And we will be jumping over there and doing some streaming of uh, Farm Sim. We'll pick up some more logs, all the good happy stuff. Yesterday's live stream is a uh, Farm Sim is already posted somewhere there. Yeah, somewhere, somewhere up in there. It was already posted. Yeah, it's just like logging. Can we can we do a million? You know, blah blah blah, that type of stuff. Dopey's just yawning her ass off right now. Um, but yeah, dudes, it's been fun as always. I know this game might be my might be a little bit boring for some people, but it's fishing. It's chill. Appreciate you guys for coming and hanging out. All the dudes for uh, coming and fishing and chilling with us. And uh, we're gonna move on over to uh, Twitch. I guess. We will catch you over there in about 20 or sooner. Peace out, dudes.